So before we end off any NBA talk, um, we definitely have to big up NBA legend himself, Michael Jordan. So Michael Jordan has agreed to purchase uh, one of the NASCAR, NASCAR series charter. Um, and Bubba Wallace has agreed to be one of his drivers. He announced earlier this month that he will be leaving Richard Petty Motorsports. So this is huge, I, think, I just think, for the culture. Uh, we all know what Bubba Wallace has experienced this year, and I'd I love to just to see Black ownership, you know, step into these spaces where you don't see us. And for, you know, him being the lone Black driver that has gone through so much just in terms of rep you know, representing for our culture to actually, you know, leave and drive under more black leadership or, or the first black leadership. So I'm really excited. I think this was a great move, um, not only financially, but again, just for moving the culture forward. So big ups to Michael Jordan and Bubba Wallace. Now I've got a quick question. Is, has it been confirmed whether or not Bubba Wallace is going to get his, his own signature pair of Jordans? So I think you know, representing for NASCAR and MJ, but he should he got to get his own pair of sneakers, man. I know you ain't gonna see him inside the car, but when he step out the car, you know, when he cross that finish line and go up and get you know get his awards, his trophies and whatnot, it might be good to see the Jays on his feet. So I'm sure Jordan's gonna bring him onto the brand in some way, shape, or form, um, whether it's an apparel line or or an exclusive uh, shoe sneaker, like you mentioned. But uh, I mean, I think this is just is great for the culture and it's great for representation as well. NASCAR is one of those sports that. Um, our culture just doesn't relate to and, and connect with because there isn't the representation. Bubba Wallace being the only African-American driver on the circuit helps. But then when you pair him with an icon like Michael Jordan, now it, it really enhances the visibility and the brand. So I'm looking forward to it. I, I've never tuned in to NASCAR before. I don't know how much I'll tune in now, but I'll be paying attention. I, I know that. I I'll, I'll at least check out his first race under the Jordan uh, team because I'm not really a NASCAR fan like that. But... I'm going to support MJ and, and what he's doing. I'm going to support uh, Bubba, Bubba Wallace. And, um, you know, it's, it's good uh, seeing us get together um, yeah. because, you know, so many times, you know, and, and going back to a conversation we had a couple of weeks ago with the whole uh, cookout reference. And it's like, you know, like we don't why we got to keep catering to you. We got people who can step in. And MJ is one of those people that has the money, he has the power to to say, All right, you know what, I'm gonna I'm gonna own something within the NASCAR organization. And you know, Bubba Wallace, listen, we gotta we gotta stick together, and we gotta help each other in in every area. Not even not even just in sports, but in general, we gotta all stick together. So I, I love seeing this. I thought it was an amazing thing that Michael Jordan did. Um, you know, ho hopefully, it, you know, it, it goes a lot better. Than his NBA franchise is is doing right now, but I do love the love it, and you know Michael Jordan is the goat. So, Smush Parker here, formerly up to Los Angeles Lakers, and you are now tuned into Real Fans Real Talk. Uh huh. This is Real Fans Real Talk. Real fans, real talk. We as real as you thought. Real.